Hey guys, thank you for coming back to my Instagram TV. We got a lot of requests for this video, so I'm gonna be doing a jewelry collection, uh, whatever, show, showroom, show, show off, I don't know. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and get started right now with my first piece I've ever copped, which is this cross right here uh, from David Yerman. It's all gold with the diamond in the middle. And you know, I always keep this with me because I always thank God, thank you Jesus for all the blessings you've given my brothers and I. Um, We'll go ahead and put this right here. Uh, as you know me, I always wear earrings. So we got a couple earrings right here. This is the fluttered out diamond and pearl from David Yerman as well, as well as the dagger from Icebox. I lost the other one and I actually lost the back to this, but um, I love this. I got a new backing coming. So shout out to Will from Icebox. You're the man. Hit him up if you guys need anything. My first watch, yo. This was my first watch right here. Saved up, got this for my birthday. This Bang. is the two-tone Datejust, all factory from Rolex. The diamonds are factory, everything. I think it's kind of dumb to buy a watch that won't hold its value or will depreciate. That's why, you know, these are like my assets. So everything I buy, I like to make sure it holds its value or appreciates. Um, so this one should do fairly well. But this one is my favorite watch right here. This one is gonna do super well. Um, this is the all gold Rolex presidential. Jeez. Yep. Brand new. That's actually my favorite watch right there. So keep killing it, Rolex. I love you guys. Um, this one was pretty cool. This was a gift from Mino. So shout out to Mino and your amazing family for the Cartier rose gold love bracelet. Jeez. It's just a classic, man. Like you can't go wrong with the classic. You know what I'm saying, Steve? Of course. So oh, I know what you're saying. And it's a gift, so I have a lot of sentimental value towards it. We'll just go ahead and leave that open. And some more Cartier, I love my rings. First up, we got the gold love bracelet, love ring, my bad, with the diamonds. Yes, sir. So that's for my pointer finger. We got the white gold with the diamonds. That's for my pinky finger. <laughs> and then last but not least, my favorite ring from Cartier. We got the rose gold flooded. I love all these rings, man. Oh, dang. Oh, man. It's not. It's not fitting? Oh, hold on. Wrong finger. <laughs> That's actually my pointer, pointer finger ring. All right. Okay, so now we move on to some more things. What do we got? As I said, I love my crosses. So here we got the yellow gold flooded out cross. Ooh. Dude, I love this bracelet so much. Or this necklace. I don't know why I can't talk today. But look at the ice. It's glistening. And to go along with that one, we got the white gold flooded out diamond chain cross right here. Ooh. Yeah, I love those those two pieces. I usually only rock those two. I don't like to be too showy with my jewelry. Um I love individual pieces. But those two go really well together. And then this one. This is my first Cuban link I've ever gotten. Yellow gold, flooded out. The Cubans kind of annoy me, man, because they get tangled up and stuff. <laughs> but anyway, this is it right here. Boom. Fully flooded from top to bottom. Yeah, that one shines really nice. Yeah, it does. Um, you guys are going to love this. Got the flooded two tooth. Grills. Show them all, show them all. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't really wear them that much, but that's those. Still gotta get used to those. Oh, we got some more. What else we got? Oh, these are dope. Again, shout out to my boy Will from Icebox, uh, Jimmy. Oh, these are my guys. favorite, yeah. We got the, um, the Spike Bangle bracelets. Flooded out, one yellow gold, one one white gold. I like to the whole like um the whole two tone thing, you know. Yeah. So got those on deck. What else we got? Oh yeah, this earring, which is the same one as the first one I showed you. But I do got another piece coming in. It's really small. It's an earring. You guys will know it right when I see it. Um. But yeah, guys, that's my jewelry collection. Steve, you can go ahead and do a close-up yeah, of everything. Yes, yes, sir. Of course, yes, I should. Look at all of this ice. Wow. 
Of course, you can't forget about the rollies. You know what I'm saying? They look real good. Whew. But yeah, guys, uh, a lot of you guys requested this video, which is why I did it. So there's my jewelry collection. Shout out to everyone who has hooked me up with all this amazing stuff. Uh, I love you guys. Stay tuned. We got a bunch of cool videos coming out. Um, God bless you. Stay safe. Stay healthy. And subscribe. Peace. about doing a review on my new whip, the 2020 Lamborghini Aventador SVJ. It took a year to come in straight from Italy. I custom built it from the ground up, from scratch. The price tag was somewhere around 585. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and start off with the exterior. I got a Nero Nemesis color option. It's the matte black finish from Lamborghini. Um, and I really wanted this car to look sinister like Batman, you know, I want to I call it the Batmobile So come on over here and you'll be able to see what I did with the brakes. I got the brakes yellow So they're carbon ceramic yellow and Along with the brakes. I also matched the interior with the ad persona Which is a customizable color option that you can do through Lamborghini Yep and then here on the side, we have the logo of the car. This is the Aventador Super Veloce Hota. What does Hota mean, Steve? Uh, J. It just means J? Yeah, it means oh, J. Okay. All right. So um, basically, this is the top of the line sports model for the Lamborghini Aventador. We got the V12 naturally aspirated engine in the back with a nice copper finish. Um, and my favorite part of the whole car, the wing. Um, this is the ALA system. So air actually flows in and out through the wing as well as the front wing of the car to balance out the weight using the air. But um, let's go ahead and get to the fun stuff. Let's do a launch control. All right, let's do it. Steve, you mind shutting your door? No, not at all, bro. So much for watching i love all of you guys so much thank you for all your love and support remember to stay safe stay healthy wash your hands praying for all of you guys out there god bless you peace